Is new head coach Bill Sachovka's message about playing aggressively getting through to his team? Yes. Sachovka, an assistant coach at Pine Forest for the past 10 years, is now the head coach of the Trojans, replacing Dean Safos, who retired. And Sachovka admits there is a difference in being the head coach. One of the differences for me is, the, is uh, actually trying to be more hands-off. I've been so involved with it for the last 10 years, coaching linebackers, and it's, now it's time for me to kind of let the coaches coach, and that's... You know, it's kind of difficult, but I get in there once every once in a while, and I'm still helping on the offense, so that for me is a big challenge. The offensive load figures to fall on senior tailback Raquel Biagas, a three-year starter, as Pine Forest searches for a quarterback. Make it to the playoffs, have a strong season, everybody work together as a team. Got pretty good team chemistry out here. Everybody came out here and stepped up from last year. <laughs> Offensive and defensive lineman Jared Marks feels the Trojans may just surprise some folks. I think we're under underestimated at the beginning of the year, and we're going to do pretty well. I think we only lost two offensive players, so we're going to do all right. With several players returning, first-year coach Bill Sachovka hopes to get Pine Forest back to its winning ways after the school has had two consecutive losing seasons. The key for us is going to be our leadership with our seniors. Uh, these seniors have been started since they've been sophomores on the, on the varsity level, so they're more than well experienced. I'm looking for them. They know what it takes to win a couple games and also to lose a couple games. And I challenge them and say, guys, this is your team. I said, you've been here for a long time, and, and you, you need to take part of it and go. Um, I'm looking for good things out of our backfield uh, and also in our secondary. We have a uh, Jamil Walker uh, has the potential of being a good receiver uh, and I'm looking to see good things out of him. So we have a lot of good things going on for us in Pine Forest. Sonny Jones, Fayetteville Online.